Good morning, guys. Welcome back to our channel. Episode number three, day two, here in Mexico, San Carlos, Sonora. Stay tuned. We're heading offshore. I'm sure something epic is gonna happen. See you guys on the water. All right, guys, finally made it out here. We're at the Yellowtail spot. There's a little island here about 18 miles from the marina. Today is a lot different day than yesterday, so it's a lot more windy. So we're gonna be fishing a lot shallower, closer to shore, protected from the wind close to this area. So we're going for Yellowtail primarily right now for the first part of the day. Uh, fishing a little heavier jigs as well to find some of that current. We have a short window, about like two to three hours before it really starts blowing. So we're gonna get, we're gonna try to get the most out of this. So stay tuned. It's gonna be an interesting morning. We just pulled up on these birds and there's lots of yellowtails subsurface. So we're trying to get one on top water. Super, super swelly out here today. There are birds diving right here. So find this for a second. A little deeper water now. Right there, right there, right there. Three o'clock. Aquí, 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 peque. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm on! Oh, the micro! Oh, the mi oh popped off! You're on the micro, Jimmy? Ah, it's such a shame. <laughs> I didn't change my hooks. So I hooked up and they go like a stray, you know, because I had this tiny hook. Oh! Oh! Yeah, you don't want to touch that one. Look at that fish, I'm seeing the size of the fish. That's a, storf that's a scorpion fish, it's probably one of the most dangerous fish in the ocean. Look at the size of the fish compared with the size of the jay. I felt some weight, but I, you know, I thought I hung up a piece of the bottom or something, but no, I had a, I had a scorpion fish. We're trying to work with the conditions, you know, it's a little tougher today. So Captain Fernando Mara is, is trying his best. So we're trying to be uh, as close as we can from the protection of the rocks, but at the same time, you know, in the right spot. So it's a delicate dance today, but we're gonna get them. Uh, we just caught a scorpion fish, first fish of the day. We missed the yellowtail just because I was rushing. And uh, yeah, we, we're trying. We, we're here, we're on the strike zone, so stay tuned. They're coming. Conditions are tough, so I'm, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try something different. So I'm gonna drop one of these, one of our eye drops, three, uh, 350, and like working really tight to the bottom. We, we're marking a lot of fish on the bottom right now. They're not super active, so I don't think many people have tried this technique here. Great opportunity for us, so I'm gonna send it down, give it a chance and see what happens, but I'm pretty confident. Trying to work it really tight to the bottom, steady retrieve. Five, ten cranks, drop again. You're on? Oh, he's, got, he's on. Uh -oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. New species. What the heck is that thing? Is that a new species? Oh my god, look at that fish. Basically, the uh, jig hit the bottom, and within a crank, he was on it. So, huh. hit it nice, nice and hard. It felt, felt like a bigger fish. At the end of the day, it's beautiful fish, just not what we're targeting. We're gonna go ahead and release. There he goes. Fishing is not always catching, guys. I uh, was a little bit seasick earlier, still not feeling 100%, but these boys are fishing hard. I'm taking a little break, and um, it's tough conditions today. It's tough conditions. The good news is tomorrow is looking a little bit better, but as the day gets on, as the day drags on tomorrow, it's gonna get a lot better. But you never know what's gonna happen. Right now, we're focusing on what's happening right now, on the present, looking for some good fish. Obviously, it's not an easy day, but we're not just gonna give up that easy. So the wind is rolling a little bit, so we are more protected here, and uh, we're gonna give it a shot. It looks good. Different area, we're sticking with it. This is what it's all about. You can just fish and, and hope. You can just fish and, and wait to catch a fish right away, you know? You gotta put the work. And uh, we're working right now. Got another hook up here from the bottom. Some small. We got a little bit of action going on now. We got color coming up. And we have another 
Calico bass hooked in the back. Made a move here to the shallower spot. Fishing 70 feet of water now. We saw a couple of yellow tails in here. So we are trying. But we tried a deeper drift. Well, not that deep, 200, 300. There's no bait out there. So we, we moved in right up against the island. We're in 65 feet of water. A friend of mine, an annoying boy, just got a couple right here on small jigs. So we're gonna give it a go. We got a hookup right here. It should be fine. We're right on top of the shallow rock. So we'll see. It's not, it's not what you think it is, but it's a decent fish. It's a decent fish. It's not a yellow gel, but pesa un poquito. All right, see what we got. Grouper? Yes, sir. Grouper, different species. What is this? Not sure what this fish is. We're gonna try to ID it when we get back. It's very similar to a strawberry grouper that we get in South Florida. And again, new species for me. Loving this. Beautiful. If you stick to it, you still get them. I'm gonna go ahead and release them. There he goes, nice. Oh, there's a yellow tail on the screen right now. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Yellow tail's on the screen. On the bottom. <laughs> Got him on. No, no, este, esto está bueno. ¿eh? Guys. No ways we on. Yellow tail jumping everywhere. We can't get the yellow tail. Here, Fernando says, okay, let's throw up a jig. I have a, a deeper rock here. Hit bottom. Right on. I'm on. This is a better fish. This is a good fish. Nice! Es un buen pescadito. Está bueno. No, no, no. Puede ser una baqueta. He's fighting like a grouper. No, 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 tiene peso, tiene peso. No es snapper, no es snapper. No es snapper porque no, no corrió. But it's a different red snapper. We're working our asses off today and. Power of slow jigging. Oh! Go to board! Yes, sir! Oh, no. That came undone. I think it's a grouper. I see a collar. I got a collar. Oh, nice one. Nice one. Slack, what's slack? This is one of the. Oh! He's on! Let's go! Hooked up, double up. Hoy, hoy ha, estado, ha estado bien difícil el tema de los yellow tails. Han estado en superficie, pero breves momentos, unos instantes muy breves. Les hemos intentado, se han pegado un par y se lo hemos perdido. Por eso es que optamos ahorita por ir aquí a una piedra que nos trajo el capitán en 380 pies. Y yo, eh, yo soy muy fiel a este jig. El color sardina, 240 gramos, strike, es muy productivo. Nada más toqué el fondo, un par de movimientos y ya tengo ahí algo enganchado. Vamos a ver qué es. Tranquilo, Capi. Tú ponlos donde hay. Sea lo que sea, es una pieza, nos mantiene activos, nos tiene pendientes. Ahí viene, color. Es un cálico. Es una muy buena opción este jig. ¿Eh? Mira, una buena piececita. Sí, sí, bien bonito. So, it's a gold, this is a gold spotted bass. It looks like a grouper, but it's actually a, a family of the, of the sea bass. Um, it's a beautiful fish. We caught a couple of these, like a smaller the other day. But 
this is like proves to you that if you stick to it, you're consistent. I say always the same thing, just adjust and adjust and adjust. Go with your captain, listen, please produce. We're gonna keep fishing here. I hope you guys are enjoying this video. So we are back at the dock again. Epic day of fishing. We caught so many fish today, so many different species. Some of them, I don't even have a clue what they are. So I'm gonna need some help with that. But made it back to the dock, reached out to the IGFA this morning and actually had to take some final measurements. Everything certified in their standards. So we just did that. And this concludes day two, episode three, here in San Carlos, Sonora, Mexico. Tomorrow is our last day, we're going again. Stay tuned, that video is gonna drop soon. Tomorrow is a fully exploration day. It's gonna be epic. My name is George with Jig Pro Fishing. See you guys in the next episode tomorrow. Thank you, team.